Hi everyone, uh, welcome back sa aking channel, uh, GTR Mat Tutorial. Okay, so in this video, I will discuss another uh, age problem. Okay, so let's start. So 11 years from now, uh, Nancy will be 3 times as old as he was 25 years ago. How old is she now? So parang may mali lang doon sa grammar, no? 3 times as old as she. Ayun. <laughs> 3 times as old as she was 25 years ago. How old is she now? So, may choices tayo. So, we have 85, 78, 36, and 43. Okay, so to answer this, kailangan ma-represent lang muna natin yung X. So, analyze natin mabut mabuti. So, ito yung mga given natin. So, 11 years from now. So, ayan, meron tayo 11 years from now. Nancy will be 3 times as old as she was. 25 years ago. So, how old is she now? Okay, so meron tayong now, merong 11 years ago, ah, 11 years from now, and 25 years ago. Okay, so gawa tayo ng table. So, isa lang yung name, no? So, si Nancy lang. So, ang hinahanap natin ay yung age, present age ni Nancy. How old is she now? Okay, present age or or now. So, hindi natin alam yung present age ni Nancy. So, laging natin ay X. O kahit anong variable lang gusto nyo. So, ang age ni Nancy now ay X. Then, i-represent natin yung 11 years from now. So, we have 11 years from now. Ilang taon na siya 11 years from now. So, ating natin. So, 11 years from now. So, 11 years from now, yung X... So, pag from now, mag add tayo. So, we have x plus 11. Tapos, meron naman tayo ditong uh, isa pa, 25 years ago. So, dito sa isa pang column, we have 25 years, 25 years ago. Okay, so 25 years ago, just subtract 25 to x. So, 25 years ago is x minus 25. So, okay, so dito tayo sa expression na to, kukuha ng magiging equation natin. So, sabi dito, Nancy will be 3 times as old as she was 25 years ago. So, yung age daw ni Nancy. 11 years from now, Nancy, Nancy will be 3 times as old as she was 25 years ago. So, yung age daw ni Nancy, 11 years from now, ay equal sa 3 times as old. 3 times as old as she was 25 years ago. Okay, so ang kailangan natin ang uh, expression ay sa 11 years from now at sa 25 years ago. So, syempre, ano, ano ba ang mas malaki dito sa dalawa? So, syempre, mas malaki yung 11 years from now sa 25 years ago. So, i-multiply natin ito or itong isa sa 3. Okay, so ganito pag-analyze nyo na isa-isa natin. Ha? 11 years from now. So, ito 11 years from now. Nancy will be 3 times as old. So, equals na yun. Equals... 3 times as old. Multiply natin to sa 3. So, yun na yung ating equation. Okay, so therefore, the equation is x plus 11. So, that is the 11 years from now. Nancy will be, ito yung equals. Nancy will be 3 times as old as she was 25 years ago. So, x minus 25. Okay, so yan ang ating uh, working equation. Okay, malinaw. So, we have Age ni Nancy, now ay X. 11 years from now is X plus 11. 25 years ago, ang age niya ay X minus 25. Then, sabi sa problem, inuulitin lang natin na para malilaw. 11 years from now, eto na yon. 11 years from now, Nancy will be, eto yun, eto yun, equals, so Nancy will be equals, 3 times, so nakamultiply sa 3, 3 times as old as she was 25 years ago. So, ito 25 years ago. Okay, so yun yung pagka-translate sa mathematical sentence. Then, so just solve for x. So, inaarap natin, how old is she now? Diba, yung x, yun yung now. Present age ni Nancy now. So, just solve for x. Kung anong masolve natin x, yun na yung age ni Nancy now. Okay, so, solve for x. So, distribute 3. 3 times x, 3 times negative 25. Okay, so just copy x plus 11. Therefore, we have 3 times x, so that is 3x. 3 times negative 25, so that is negative 75. 
combine the x and the constant. So, tandaan na, yung x tsaka 3x para is positive. So, ang gagawin nyo lagi, nadalhin nyo yung, pagkocombine nyo, nadalhin nyo lagi dun sa mas mataas. So, yung x ang ililipat natin dito. Kasi pag itong 3x ang nilagay natin sa kabila, same answer din, pero magkakaroon pa tayo ng negative at dyan sa algebra, kapag may negative, doon na medyo baka malito pa pag plus or pag minus. Okay, so kaya pinakamaganda, yung maliit, yun ang dadalhin dito. Pwede naman mag-solve either sa left or right. So, sa right na lang natin dalhin. So, minus x to both sides. So, x minus x, so 0 na yan. So, just copy 11 and negative 75. So, we have 11 equals 3x minus x. So, that is positive 2x minus 75. Kailangan x ang matira. So, tanggalin si negative 75. Add 75 to both sides para mawala sa right side. So, add 75 to both sides. So, negative 75 plus 75 is 0. 11 plus 75. So, that is equal to 86 is equal to 2x. Then, last step, divide both sides by by 2. Para mawala na si 2x na lang matitira. 2 divided by 2 is 1. Okay, so just divide. 86 divided by 3. Pagpalitin na natin ng pwesto. So, x is equal to 8 divided by 2. So, that is 4. 6 divided by 2, that is 3. So, therefore, ang h ni Nancy now ay 43. So, the correct answer is letter D. Okay, checking. Check natin kung tama yung sagot natin. So, ang h daw ni Nancy now is 43. So, ito ay 43. 11 years from now, ano na ano ang age niya? So, plus 11. 43 plus 11, so that will become 54. Okay? And then, 25 years ago, so subtract tayo ng 25. Uh, 43 minus 25, so that is equal to 13 minus 5, that is 8. So, four, 3 minus 2, so we have 18. Okay? So, therefore, ito ay 18. Okay, so at the age niya, now, 11 years ago and 25 years, uh, 11 years from now and 25 years ago. So, substitute natin dito. Ang 54 ay equal ba sa 3 times 18? Yun, so exacto, no? So, 3 times 18, so that is equal to 54. So, therefore, tama yung answer natin, 54 equals 54. Okay? Therefore, the correct answer is letter D. Okay, so kung first time niyo sa channel na ito, huwag niyo kakalimutan mag-subscribe and hit the bell button para updated kayo sa mga susunod pang mga videos. Okay, so thank you for watching. Bye-bye!